Merry Christmas to one and all. A special thanks to all of our clients. Uh, we are ending the year with the highest roster of clients that we have ever had. Uh, and uh, I would have thought uh, our lead generation would have slowed down in December, but it hasn't. That's our second uh, best year for lead generation. So we'll start 2024 in a really strong place also. Um, but we stand on the shoulders of giants. Uh, our client roster is diverse. It's made up of people in all manner of industries. And while those relationships can be tough at times due to economic circumstances, due to um, Google and the tech companies making things uh, difficult, and sometimes there are just personality issues that need to be overcome. I am uh, very proud uh, of the pragmatism that is shown by clients, but also by our staff to get things done. Our, our job really is about generating revenue or leads or whatever it is that your brand uh, requires, your business objectives are. It's our job to deliver upon them and do it in a way that educates uh, you. I'm not going to spend a long winding uh, period of time on this video. I'd imagine a lot of people, given it's the 21st, have already finished up for the year. I just wanted to say thank you, um, really thank you. Uh, it has been a tough year for all of us for a whole range of reasons. I'm sure each and every one of us um, can reflect upon. But the one thing that I'd like to ask you to reflect upon uh, this Christmas break is about the positive impacts that you make uh, in other people's lives. I'm not talking about, you know, giving to charity or uh, some grand gesture. I'm really talking about the small things, the smile as you walk down the street to someone that you don't know, um, letting someone in uh, and waving them through um, when uh, you're on the road or as you cross a pedestrian crossing, just giving that wave of thanks the uplifting comment that you might make to a friend to encourage them to take the plunge on something or simply to lend a, a caring ear. Those personal moments contribute to you being a better professional uh, operator um, because people see that as genuine and they engage with you and they trust you and then they'll share more with you. You'll learn more, you'll grow, your business will develop uh, and ultimately you'll succeed in the objectives that you've set yourself. And so just take that time to acknowledge that, you know, life is hard, but that you are engaging with it. You are striving to be better. Uh, and I'm very thankful for the team that surrounds me uh, and our management team uh, at the board level. Um, but it's our frontline staff uh, who really do the, the heavy lifting week in, week out. And I'm very proud of the, the company that uh, I get to sit atop of. I've just had my final management meeting for the year. And uh, the number one thing that I wanted to express to the management team, and I really would like to express to you, is that it isn't my business. It is the sum of its parts. Uh, I don't do the operational work. I don't do account management. I'm increasingly doing less sales work. Um, and so that means that it's the individual people that are doing the work. And while we don't always get it wrong, we always strive to indemnify and be better. Uh, and that is what 2024 is going to be about for us, professionalism a focus on being the best possible company that we can be and to deliver the best possible results for you. So be expectant, be hungry in 2024, but over the next couple of weeks, enjoy the break. Hopefully the weather is good for us um, and look forward to seeing you next year. Go well.